So though it is possible for a woman of a certain age to look like a babe in a bikini, Heather is going to need some serious help from cosmetic surgeon Jan Stanek, makeup artist Ruby Hammer and cosmetic dentist Sarinda Hundle. So do you think that smoking 30 cigarettes a day for 30 years has resulted in the way she looks? Yes, it has, almost certainly. It has affected her skin um, and she has aged prematurely mm. as a result of that. It is important that she stops smoking because if she can't stop smoking, we can't operate, we can't do anything for her. So that's the precondition of any um, help that I can offer her. Are you prepared to operate on her at all if she continues to smoke? No. Surgically, we can do several things. In her face, uh, we can, uh, rather than going for facelifting, we can actually put some fat back in, in her face and therefore her skin is not going to be as saggy as, as before. We're going to do her eye bags because eye bags are always worth treating because they make you look tired. Now what about this body, Anne? Because obviously we've got to get her in a bikini well, at the end. So what can we do? Well, we can't obviously lift the whole body. Right. We can lift parts of it. Mm. In the abdomen, um, what we're going to do is we're going to remove um, excess skin and reshape. In the breasts we're going to uplift and put a small implant in. And also she has quite a bit of excess uh, here at the, uh, at the back. So what we'll do is we'll lift the skin and take away some of that and create a better fold in the buttock. Ruby, you've heard what Jan's going to do. What can you add? Well, the wonderful thing is he's going to do rather a lot. So it makes my job a lot, lot easier. <laughs> Once your body's ready to face that beach, I'm going to have to show you how to sort of keep it sun-kissed, give her an all-over tan or a fake tan so you don't have to ever go back to that sunbed. And exfoliating the skin to make it more silky and smoother, making sure there's hair removal done properly and just tip-top grooming your feet and nails and everything that's going to make you look like a real bombshell on that beach. Surinda? You've heard the bad news, 30 fags a day for 30 years. If you give me a big wide smile, Heather, I mean, yeah, you can tell straight away. Teeth are really badly discoloured. And not only that, what you can also see, the teeth have actually moved position. Um, when you're a smoker, one of the things you do get is bad gums with it and a lot of gum disease. She's got a very narrow smile and her teeth actually look very, very long now because her face is really long and slender. So what I intend to do is, first of all, is get her gums in order, actually get her gums really healthy. We're going to make her teeth not so long. We're going to actually make them a bit shorter, if anything. Close up the spaces that you have, but give her a nice, broader smile. And, you know, it'll just take years off her straight away.